Hey there, beautiful people. How you all going? Well, 2019's upon us right now. Did you guys have a good New Year's and Christmas? Yep, good. All right, let's get into 2019. Let's go. Today, I'm going to be talking about the Bird Box Challenge. Bird Box is a movie currently on Netflix and has had over 45 million streams. In the movie, monsters cause people to kill themselves whenever they see them. So people wear blindfolds in this movie so that they won't see the monsters and kill themselves. Poor Sandra Bullock. Anyone who winds up with her seems to be in some sort of a disaster or, or dangerous situation. Like in Speed or Gravity or Ryan Reynolds in The Proposal. The Bird Box Challenge entails wearing a blindfold and completing a seemingly innocuous task while doing so. Fear not, this challenge is not like the Tide Pod Challenge or the Cinnamon Challenge. I mean, it is just as dangerous and as stupid, depending on what you do. Now, some of these videos have been shared online and on Facebook, and some of the challenges people are doing are relatively tame. For instance, here's a guy playing the guitar while blindfolded. <laughs> Now that's pretty impressive. Here's another one where a man and his children are walking around the house with a blindfold on. Come on! Come on, Hakeem! Oh. <laughs> oh man. I know you shouldn't really laugh at a child for like bashing into a wall, but Jesus, it's pretty funny. But the shit lord himself, Jake Paul, has decided to join in and he has taken the Bird Box Challenge to the extreme. What happened to the internet videos of the past? You know, they used to be entertaining and everything. Like there was the flash mobs. You remember the flash mob videos? Those were great. Everyone coming together and creating a dance. Mm. 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 Not, <laughs> not like that, but you, you get the idea. Better dancing than that. We went from doing the Harlem Shake. And do the Harlem Shake. To planking. Go. To now blindfolded driving. The Paul brothers can't seem to go more than a few weeks without saying something stupid or ridiculous. So Jakey, Jakey, Jakey boy, I can't believe I actually started to feel a little bit sorry for you after watching Shane Dawson's documentary series about you. You have a young, impressionable audience, which is something that you love to exploit. Buy that merch. Buy that merch. Buy that merch. Where's your Jiminy Cricket on your shoulder telling you what to do, what's right and wrong? What? What'd you say? Oh, he's in the suicide forest with Logan. Oh, okay. My mistake. That makes sense. You have a platform with an audience. Just like mine. I mean, mine's a little bit smaller than yours. Oh, that being said, uh, go like, share, comment, subscribe. Jake, you have an audience which for some reason look up to you and despite you putting a warning at the start of the video, kids are still going to go out there and emulate your actions no matter what you say or do. But at the end of the day, the responsibility is not you at all. I mean, nothing could go wrong, right? Well, by now, you've probably heard the warnings from police about the bird box challenge. Well, it's pretty obvious that covering your eyes while driving, like, uh, doing something like driving is just not smart. Or we like not to say that's just dumb. Not smart at all, yeah. This is the result of a Utah teen blindfolding herself while driving. What was she thinking? She lost control of her truck, crossed into oncoming traffic, hit an wow. SUV, then slammed into a light pole. She is lucky because no one dangerous. was hurt. But come on, people, stop Very it. Very dangerous. Now, I don't know if this girl is a fan of yours, but she's 17, so let's just assume she is. I bet when she was driving blindfold, she was like, It's every day, bro. It's every day, bro. I said it's every day, bro. I'm, I'm so sorry you had to hear. I'm sorry you had to hear that. Now, you're just lucky that no one hurt themselves this time, Jakey boy. So just in case no one gets the message, uh, don't drive while blindfolded. Jakey, you inspire fucking idiots to copy what you do. And I think you do not give a fuck. You're kind of like Ricky Bobby's dad in Talladega Nights. You don't drive with your eyes. You drive with your heart. This is just dumb. I can't see a thing. I hear you, Ricky, and I agree. But kids see Jake do it, and just like my daughter does, monkey see, monkey do. You gotta feel the road. I feel like the car could drive itself. 
Ricky, this car isn't a Tesla, it can't drive itself. See what could happen now that you've inspired your fans to do it, Jake. <laughs> It won't be long until we see a news story of a car crashing, trying to do the bird box challenge and, and crashing into a house and killing someone. Also, check this out. This is another thing Jake did for the bird box challenge. Go on, go. Jake, Jake. Bro, chill. No, bro. I don't wish harm to Jake at all. No one, in fact. Anyone doing the bird box challenge, just stay out of the fucking street. Don't do anything stupid or dangerous. Don't play with knives, nothing like that. Don't fucking play with knives just because I suggested it. No. Stop it. Okay? But if you get hit by a car, Jake, while running around in traffic, um, don't expect anyone to have a huge amount of sympathy for you. YouTube has a lot to answer for, as they let the Paul brothers get away with quite a lot of shit. But, luckily, they stepped up this time because of the guidelines. Finally. And it states here, Harmful or dangerous content. Don't post videos that encourage others to do things that might cause them to get badly hurt. Especially kids. Jake, Logan, that is your demographic. Listen carefully. Videos showing such harmful or dangerous acts may get age-restricted or removed depending on their severity. Which means that finally YouTube has done the right thing and removed that dangerous content. But the fact of the matter is they both get to upload crap like that all the time. How many times do the Paul brothers get to get away with shit before you shut down their account? Oh wait, they make too much money on the site and you need to keep that cash cow flowing, yeah? Even vegans wouldn't be opposed to this cow dying yeah, I mean, Jake and Logan are cash cows on YouTube, but the only cash cow I want to see is on sunrise in the morning. Just go away, okay? Oh, fuck, why is this accent so weird, you know? <laughs> Fucking shit. Just stop this stupid shit before someone dies, like a tourist snapping a selfie and falling off the edge of a cliff. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it was a little bit educational for you all. I'm sure another stupid challenge will come along sometime soon. I mean, it's just the start of 2019. It is January. So... <laughs> I could say that with a fucking straight face. It's fucking January. There's still a long way to go, alright? We've got... I want more stupidity, internet. Come on. Give me more stupid challenges. I want to see them. Comment, like, share, and subscribe. Oh, also, if you subscribe on YouTube, click that notification bell because then you'll be notified the second, no, the millisecond, I upload another video. I'll catch you beautiful fuck knuckles in the next video. Au revoir!